Uh, if Sasquatch was racing, what are the what are the conditions like for for, for the Squatch? Well, uh, Squatch is going to be real hot, uh, <laughs> yeah. you know, out there in this weather. You know, today we actually do cool down. Today will be the coolest day uh, of the week. The weekend though does heat up, so by Sunday temperature is likely back in the 90s. So yeah, a stretch of heat setting up, and we'll start to see it creeping in by the end of the weekend. So enjoy these next couple of days that will be cooler. 63 degrees to start. Still a mild morning here, but we have seen those clouds filtering in and right now it's cloudy in Portland will stay cloudy the rest of the morning that goes for much of the valley even seeing some light scattered showers here across portions of the coast right now but that morning mist spots of drizzle and even some very light showers out there today we're just getting that stronger marine push of winds those clouds are stacking up and again, this will likely shift into the valley here through much of the day. We likely won't see much rainfall here in Portland, but can't rule out maybe just a quick spotty drizzle around the valley somewhere. Yet most places will be dry today. Uh, so quick look here at our forecast for the coast. Temperatures in the mid to upper 60s. Again, that morning mist drizzle, possibly some light showers out there too. I do see some sun breaks again by the late afternoon. We'll get just a few breaks, but staying mostly cloudy to mainly cloudy out there today. Uh, in the valley, expect to see a cooler day. We're back in the upper 70s today. Clouds will taper, and by the evening time, we'll see a sunny finish. But the clouds will likely linger into about noon today. Out on the east sides, we're also expecting the sun to uh, stick around out there. Another hot day in the upper 80s. Those clouds not making it over the Cascade Range. So we'll keep it sunny out there and in the gorge today. Temperatures vary on the west end near Hood River. Cooler, low to upper 70s, and the Dalles today on the east side, back in the 80s. So we're still tracking heat. Take a look at our weather pattern going into next week. We still have this heat expanding into the Pacific Northwest. Our, uh, again, heat wave sets up mostly on Monday, but even Sunday we'll see some temperatures back in the 90s. We're expecting prolonged days here in the 90s, possibly a few triple-digit days as well. Take a look at this temperature trend, and you can see that clear boost in temperatures, again, really setting up by Monday. Temperatures in the mid-90s, upper 90s Tuesday, triple-digit weather possible next week. So tough sleeping weather as temperatures likely hover in the upper 60s, maybe 70 degrees overnight too. So again, tough to beat this heat. Try and make some plans. You can always head to a library to cool down, maybe head to a friend's house. Uh, so again, heat setting up next week. But this weekend, still gorgeous out to the Oregon coast. Uh, we'll see a partly sunny day on Saturday, mid-upper 60s, a little warmer on Sunday, mostly sunny and gorgeous. If you're planning some hiking over the weekend up in the mountains, we'll see the 70s and the 80s. Sunny skies and just a gorgeous weekend to get outside. Here's your seven day forecast. So today we'll see a mix of clouds and then some sunshine by the afternoon. Temperatures cooler today. We're back in the upper 70s, maybe touching 80 degrees. Saturday still in the low 80s and a partly sunny day. Uh, beautiful out, but Sunday warms up. Then that heat wave sets up Monday. We're looking at temperatures in the mid 90s and those temperatures rising possibly into the triple digits by the middle parts of next week. All right. Thank you very much, Kelly.